Well, I think this is a major and exciting investment by Belfast City Council into leisure transformation. Obviously, we have a number of leisure centres across the city, north, south, east and west, that are not in the best possible state of repair. And we want to uplift them with this major £105 million investment over 10 years. It's unique in these islands and in Europe that we're putting such an investment, not only to building and refurbishing the leisure centres uh, for leisure activities, but also to try to tackle the significant health inequalities that are experienced by many communities in Belfast. But again, we've saved money in terms of what we put into leisure. And with that money, we have been able to create a capital fund of £105 million over 10 years. So we're going to have a phased system of investments. Uh, we're going to start off with Anderson's Town. Well, Olympia is already nearly built in South Belfast. Uh, Anderson's Town in Brook and West. And the Robinson Centre, which is closed down at the moment, is going to be a part of the phase one. And then we're looking at phasing uh, the refurbishment of the other leisure centres across Belfast. And we're trying to make them all unique, that people from across Belfast will go to them uh, for those unique speciality. So Anderson's Town is a family swim with flumes. This is more, the Robinson Centre will be more aquatic um, and uh, uh, centre for excellence. Well, we're, we're here this morning in East Belfast at Avenue Leisure Centre um, and it's important to speak to the users of our leisure centres at the moment to outline the plans for Robinson Centre in East Belfast and then we'll be going across all the other leisure centres to consult with users there to outline the plans in Phase 1 for Anderson's Town and Brook. Uh, but you know, I think people will be excited that there's such a significant investment to upgrade the leisure centres, improve them, uh, create better pools, better health facilities but also to try to tackle some of the health problems that people face across the city. Well, obviously, people use the leisure centres already, but they are, they, they, they are historic buildings and there's a need to invest in them. So obviously we've talked in advance with users and local people to see what they wanted in the centres. Now we've come up with a sort of master plan of what we see in each of the centres and we want to go back out to make sure that they people are happy with that and have any other ideas about how they can input into this major, major investment. Everybody in their own centre wants their centre to come first. Obviously, we're trying to make sure we balance out the investment in north, south, east and west Belfast in a phased way. So in this phase, uh, east and west will benefit. Uh, GERD has already been developed in north and uh, Olympia has been developed in south Belfast. So people want their centre first. But you know, I think what you'll see at the end is every uh, part of the city will benefit for leisure transformation. We hope more people will use them and that we will also have an impact on health inequalities in East Aurora. And time scale for, for phase one? It's, it's approximately 2019 if we get all the planning approvals sorted out. We're trying to do a number of them together to make it more cost effective. But hopefully by 2019 you'll see uh, the fruits of this in, these endeavours.